Hi, I'm Lauren from LSP Actions. Welcome to this showcase video of editing newborns in Evoto using the LSP Evoto presets to help speed up and streamline your workflow even faster. You can watch the complete tutorial number one about getting presets into Evoto, what they do and how they work, which goes through a lot slower. In this tutorial, I'm going to go really quickly and just showcase you some recipe guides um, and some kind of really cool practices when using the LSP Evoto presets within Evoto and some extra tips and tweaks you can use yourself. If I'm going too fast at any point, you can watch the first tutorial, which is a lot slower and a lot more in depth. We're just gonna race in and get started, assuming you've watched tutorial number one, um, or perhaps you're just curious about how these presets work and you want to see. So we're gonna come into the presets and find the LSP uh, newborn presets in Avoto. These load in and make your Avoto editing even faster. On our screen right now, we have this beautiful picture by Sarah uh, Alton Photography. And as detailed in tutorial number one for the newborn presets or any of the presets, in your color adjustment section, you're gonna to wanna to turn off real-time color adjustments. So let's dive in and get started. The presets do not change your white balance and exposure. So we're just gonna jump in and change this a little bit manually. Evoto, I believe, is best suited as a mid-workflow tool um, for skin and things like that. Um, between you know your Lightroom and your Photoshop final edit. But in this tutorial, we're literally gonna stay within Evoto the entire time. You can check out the other Evoto tutorials for working this into your workflow between Lightroom and Photoshop and some best practices for file size, um, what to edit and when. So we edit your exposure. You can also change your white balance if needed. If you've got this right in camera already, you don't need to do this at this stage. Now let's dive straight into these presets. In the Lemon Sky Edit, you can literally just hit um, any of these. You have all which changes every aspect of your image um, to the most amazing recipe, or you have the base, skin, polish, and end. We also have the manual editing bases, image toners, baby skin, skin retouch, skin polish, refiners, and image finish. If Oto is quick, these make it even quicker, even more streamlined, and super easy to batch and sync across your whole gallery. Now, I'm just gonna hit Lemon Sky All and already, look at that, that was one click. Let's see our before and after. Before, after. Really, really quick. Now, let's turn that off. I'm gonna go through a slower edit now. That was literally just hitting all. Let's go into the manual editing section and I'm gonna show you quickly how we can race through this section too. And nothing is going to be as fast in a photo as hitting one preset like we just did. But I'm going to show you the second fastest way, and that's working through the manual editing section. So let's choose which base we're going to apply. Um, you can click through these and decide which one's your favourite. That's Calm Touch. Let's go for uh, Perfect Sock straight out of camera base. Beautiful. I'm going to leave that on 100%. Now we're into the image tone section. Uh, you have tones called a warmer tone. I'm just going to hit warmer tone, but bring this down a little bit down to, uh, let's say about this level here. Next up, we have the baby skin. This is in the blemish fridge section of Evoto. If you wanted to change anything in the blemish removal here or paint or add anything in. How about we go skin fix full? The cool thing about these presets is I've preloaded these to already work um, if you have parents and siblings in the image too. And now we're into skin retouch section. The skin retouch section works on Evoto's skin retouching section here. So you can use the brush to brush anything away, or you can change the sliders and tweak a little bit if you wanted to. You'll probably find uh, you don't need to. I always recommend uh, zooming in to 100% after using this section, just to make sure that you're happy with the edit and that Evoto hasn't accidentally taken away any eyelashes, fingernails, um, body areas such as nipples or belly button or anything like that here. You know, so just double check that. Now we're into the skin retouch section. Uh, I'm gonna use soft and tone, perfect soft and tone for newborn. If you find that's a little bit strong, you can always just go to sweep and you can adjust it yourself. But for this image, we want that polish finish. We're gonna go for perfect. Skin polish, again, we've got sprinkle perfection and Vogue. Um, how about we go for Vogue? And again, this is gonna affect um, different settings are loaded inside, secretly behind the scenes for mom, dad and siblings if they're in the image too. Now we're onto the refiners. This is where we refine our uh, beanbag background, texture, eye and clothes, anything like that. I'm going to hit beanbag soft. 
and you can see this is really smooth the bean bag down. If you find any of the background refiner sections are too, oh sorry, going really creaky. Can you hear this in the background there? <laughs> Creaking away. Um, that's my desk. If you find any of the bean bag um, or any of these things are too strong, you can come over onto a Voto's background section and you can just turn this all down a little bit if you wanted to. Now we're into image finish. Each one of these has a different feel um, and refinement for your finished polished image if you want to finish it in Evoto. For this, of course, I'm going to click Lilac Fairy and you can change the strength of this if you wanted to. So let's see where we were after and before. Huge, huge difference. Already a beautiful straight out of camera image. Gorgeous baby girl. And we've just gone in and given it that polished finish to the image. I'm just going to take the purple tone just a tiny bit out of the white balance, warm it up a touch, and then we're done. Absolutely beautiful. And you can use Evoto's healing tools if you want to. I find these are not quite as capable as Photoshop yet. Um, and they can take a little bit longer um, to use. But, you know, if you wanted to stay within Evoto to do this, you can do. It's a great option that Evoto op, um, offers some healing tools, but again, you know, Photoshop is still leading, in my opinion, in that sense. Coming up in the next tutorial, I'm going to race through a ton of images editing with these. Literally just, you know, between 1 and 10, 12 seconds per image, bam, bam, bam. Everyone with a different edit to show you just how capable Evoto is and even more capable with the LSP presets installed. So I hope you enjoyed that um, editing tutorial. You can find the information on the LSP Actions website and you can download Evoto from evoto.ai. I'm Lauren, thanks for watching and thanks Sarah.